hi guys welcome back um this is a vlog and this is today is thursday and i have a super i mean super busy weekend okay super super busy weekend i have a bride that i have to make up starting from today i'm about to take darlene to school she's already prepared like everything is set stand stand i'm not carrying you she's here she's eating everything just waiting for me to take her to school so when i drop her off i'm going immediately because i don't know where the the house is today is her court wedding and then saturday i'll be working with the same bride for her white wedding and um, the after party so i'll take you guys along i wish i hope i can do it because i want you guys to see a cameroonian uh party or wedding here in finland okay and then tomorrow i have another client this weekend the only free day i have or the only day i have will be sunday monday i'll be traveling oh my god it's 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 crazy it's going to be crazy the week has been so busy i don't even have time for myself i have not, packed, I have not cleaned my house and i don't like traveling without cleaning so um i'm all ready as well i'm just going to take put on my blazer on this jumpsuit <laughs> realized inside the train that I took the wrong train I have been on the wrong direction <laughs> oh my god I'm so nervous I have just 10 minutes to be there <sighs> this has never happened to me especially when I'm going to work I am really so nervous because I left so early and this is me here 10 minutes to time and I'm still at the train station waiting for the train I'm so nervous I don't know how this lady is going to react in my heart i'm praying that she's not even ready <laughs> so that she won't say anything but i already sent her a message to tell her that i'm on my way so she does not get nervous because i know how bright can be oh my god oh my god this is so messed up like my day is already getting spoiled and the train is here right now guys i'm back home today has been so stressful however super successful okay you must have seen the look that i created and the bride was so graceful she was so patient i got there 30 minutes late i was so nervous i was so stressed but she was so graceful she didn't really mind and this look that i created was so risky because she didn't really give me a look that she wants she didn't send a picture and it's always very risky when your client says you know just do just create because it could go either way it could be bad it could be good and she was just like just do something that matches with my outfit so yeah i had to create that look and she liked it and i was happy i ended up doing three different uh people makeup on three different people so that was also good <laughs> and from there i went straight to darling school i didn't even have the time to like film i went straight to pick her up because it was almost time and i'm so hungry I have not eaten nothing since morning apart from the cup of cappuccino that i took that i drank and guys the hunger in my stomach okay eh? <laughs> but i have plums and plantain in the oven super excited you know that's a delicacy here and that plum butter plum okay butter plum so i'm waiting for it to get ready so i can eat and yeah 
Dali too, I'm preparing some rice and stew so she can also eat after that. I think we are going to just nap or yeah, just rest for the rest of the day. But this bride that I did her makeup today, I have to do her makeup again on Saturday because today was her cut wedding and Saturday is her white wedding. So I have to do her makeup again, follow her to church and back to the hall as well. So it's going to be a super, super busy weekend for me and it's crazy guys. However, I'm ready, I'm pumped, and it's money. So if not, why not? I'm happy. Good morning. Guys, I can't even show you my my real face because the, it's on the bags. The bags. Is it on the eye bags? The bags under my eyes. Hmm? Tiredness. In fact, lack of enough sleep. Woo! I'm going to be wearing this gogo the whole day. This fat gogo like this because my eyes are not even appetizing. In fact, let me show you what I'm talking about. Can you guys see? Mm. I can't. Plus, there's sun to help. I'm I'm a darling school. I'm dropping darling off right now. And I have a few things to do. I have to make some ASOS returns. There's this very beautiful dress that I got from ASOS. And I'm a size 38 and 38 was not available but because the dress was too gorgeous I wanted to take 36 and I was like no it's going to size me and guess what they did not I ordered with a couple of other dresses just because the particular dress did not size me I'm taking everything back so from here I'm going straight to the post office and then I go to town I have to check Zara I saw some things online and I want to see if they are already in store I'll take you guys along. I'm in the mall right now and I came a little bit early and honestly guys this is the most rest I'm going to have today that I'm very sure of so I'm taking advantage of it I'm just waiting I'm in front of Zara actually I'm waiting for them to open up I think they have about 30 minutes to open up and they just dropped this new collection and it's the polka dot collection guys if you are a lover of polka dot eh Mm. this is so nice it has that kick to it if you're a lover of polka dots please check out zara i saw it online it dropped i think yesterday or two days ago i'm going i'm going to put it on my instagram i don't know before this video goes up i must have shown it on my instagram i know that it's not going to be in store but i just want to check to see and the the this collection is a little bit on the pricey side just like the you guys remember the yellow skirt that i did the multicolored skirt that i did on my haul on my last video and i was like i sent it back the first time and got it again and i'm hoping that with the prices that i see on this collection it's going to be worth it because if it's not i'm going to buy and i'm going to take it back and i'm waiting and i'm going to wait for it to come down to the original price 19 euros 12 euros 29 euros because the the, the cheapest thing like a pair of trousers polka dot trousers 69 euros or 79 euros so most of the things are 80 euros 79 euros you know so I'm, I'm i doubt but i'll take you guys along i just want to chill here and rest a bit i have a pretty 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 i have been saying it i know it's getting boring i have a very busy day today as well i have to go home clean because this is the only day i have the opportunity to clean like i said i always like to travel when i'm traveling i like to leave my house as clean and dry as possible you know and i'm going to try to eat everything in the fridge that is eatable and just preserve the rest and then i have to take darling to my friend's place she's going to sleep over there because tomorrow i work i start working early i have to meet my client at the hotel super early so i don't want to i can't go there with darling good morning guys it's saturday and honestly i can't even tell you how my day ended yesterday all i remember is i dropped darling off at my friend's place and it's morning it's like 6 40 and i'm heading to the hotel now to go and start doing the bright makeup actually my friend kelly and i will be working on the bride she is doing her hair and I'm doing her makeup and I think I have two other bridesmaids to do their makeup as well so um, I'm just going to step out now really quick catch my bus and drink because I don't really know where the hotel is 
and let me just go ahead first. Let me sort myself. I'll, I'll take you guys along the whole process of making of the bride or maybe the end result. Finally made it to the hotel on time. Finally made it to the hotel on time. And I got beat by the rain, okay? It's been so stressful. Kelly's already here. And uh, I already have a headache because I missed the tram, entered the wrong tram, it should. back home and guys I successfully worked on three people the bride and two bridesmaids with the help of my friend Kelly so she went back home and I'm home now and I could not go to church because guys I even tried taking an uber but it was too expensive and i was just like since they don't really need me that much in, in church there's not much that i need to do i gave the maid of honor uh, my powder and um, lip gloss for her to touch the bright face just in case so i have about um 30 minutes to rest i have another client that will be coming here very soon so i can do her face and makeup as well She's also a guest to that wedding and after that I'm heading back to the hotel and um, I'll do some touch-ups on the bride's face. Maybe I just change her lip, uh, lip paint. Uh, I'm definitely going to put a liquid lipstick this time around, something bright. And just touch up anything that needs to be touch, touched on her face. And from there we are going to the hall together. Trainer. Nobody is very disappointed that she know where she's not packaged herself when <laughs> Mom Tommy is out to play. Out. 
That's how you. Sweat, Today out. is Operation Sucking In on Tea after happy hours. Guys, we are. Guys, it's been a hectic day. No one day. We don't think I'm going to my me. I'll take my sweater back. It's been a hectic day for Kelly and I. You but know. We but we move. But we move. I hold the card there. I hold that card there, me so. I show you. guys today is sunday and guys yesterday was hectic <laughs> i can't even stop to explain to you the tiredness in my body i we went to the party and left at 5 a.m in the morning i actually got home around at about 6 a.m and i slept just for like two hours because i have to wake up this morning and go for my Corona test, which I'm right on my way now. For my Uber. From there, I'm going straight to pick Darlene up, so I can bring her, wash her hair, and at least make her look presentable for tomorrow. But this weekend has been crazy. This lighting is crazier. <laughs> hello guys Woo. this vlog is going to be the craziest most uncoordinated vlog ever because like the clips are just cut out but i just wanted to take you guys through a busy weekend in my life and guys i'm so sorry i could not give you you know i did not take the most interesting part of that wedding but you know the little ones that i could i did and <coughs> kelly did all the, the vlogging in the hall i was so busy trying to look for food trying to you know just have fun so yes today's monday i slept i was like i'm a little bit refreshed now i rested a bit and i feel much more better and stronger like it's a new week and besides i'm going on vacation like vacation vacation we have i have about 15 minutes to call the uber everything is ready darling is dressed up already eaten and guys the packing that i did this time because i didn't have enough time I had too many clients even up to yesterday, I had one client, but I, I didn't even see the message because I did not check, uh, check my phone on time. So I missed her, her appointment that she was trying to make. And I only saw her message at night. I thank God so, so much for, for, for the clients. Like, I'm so blessed. I am so thankful. I didn't even know that this time will come where I'll have so many clients and I'll even turn down clients. And I'm so happy. You guys, all my clients, all those who recommend me, all those who sit in the in the room and call my name for the right reason. Thank you. You are making a girl's dream come true. Okay. Everything I know about makeup and fashion, I taught myself. I'm learning. So any small mistake you see, please bear with me. I'm still learning. Okay. And you guys, I'm so, so grateful. Like you guys are definitely putting food on my makeup is slowly becoming a job for me, honestly. Like based on July and this month, it has been good. 
God has been good. So I'm so grateful. But I have about 15 minutes to order an Uber now to the airport. We are going to, we are traveling today to Germany. And I'm definitely going to do more of vlogs. You guys know when I'm out of Finland, I don't really do fashion videos per se. But I'm definitely going to do more vlogs. And, and guys, see. But I have a few pre-filmed videos that I'll up, up, upload definitely. Yes, I'm going to see you guys when I get to the airport.